Hello everyone, now let us discuss about medical terminology of special senses. The first term is agusia, which is nothing but loss of sense of taste. Uh, a or a means without, gusis means taste. So agusia is loss of sense of taste. The next is amblopia. Ambly means dull or dim. Amblopia means term used to describe the loss of vision in an otherwise normal eye. Because of muscle imbalance, it cannot focus in synchrony with the other eye. Sometimes it is called as wandering eyeball or a lazy eye. The next term is an anosmia. Anosmia which is nothing but total lack of sense of smell. Osmi means smell or odor. The next is barotrauma. Damage or pain mainly affecting the middle ear as a result of pressure changes. It occurs when the pressure in the outer side of the tympanic membrane is higher than on the inner side. For example, when flying in an aeroplane or diving or swallowing or holding your nose and exhaling with your mouth closed usually opens the auditory tubes allowing the air in the middle ear to equalize the pressure. The next term is blepharitis. Blepher means eyelid. Itis means inflammation. Blepharitis is nothing but inflammation of eyelid. The next is conjunctivitis. Similarly, itis means inflammation. Conjunctiva means Conjunctivitis means inflammation of the conjunctiva. It is also called as pink eye when caused by bacteria such as pneumococci, staphylococci or haemophilus influenza. It is very contagious and more common in children. Conjunctivitis may also be caused by irritants such as dust, smoke or pollutants in the air in which case it is not contagious. The next term is corneal abrasion. A scratch on the surface of the cornea, for example, from a peck of dust or damage to contact lens. Symptoms include pain, redness, watering, blurred vision, sensitivity to bright light and frequent blinking. The next is corneal transplant. A procedure in which a defective cornea is removed and a donor cornea of similar diameter is soon in. It is the most common and most successful transplant operation. Since the cornea is avascular, antibodies in the blood that might cause rejection do not enter the transplanted tissue and rejection rarely occurs. This is an important point. As cornea is avascular, the chances of rejection are very less. And the shortage of donor corneas has been partially overcome by the development of artificial corneas made of plastic. The next term is diabetic retinopathy. Retino means retina. Pathy means suffering. Pathos or pathy means suffering. So diabetic retinopathy is nothing but a degenerative disease of the retina due to diabetes mellitus in which the blood vessels in the eye are damaged or new ones grow and interfere with the vision. The next term is diplopia. In simple terms, diplopia means double vision. An image appears as two images. The next is extropia. It is turning outwards of the eye. X means out, tropia means turning. Extropia means turning outward of the eye. The next term is keratitis. Keret means cornea. Keratitis is nothing but inflammation or infection of, a, of the cornea. The next is meiosis, which is nothing but construction of the pupil. Meiosis is construction of the pupil. Midriasis. Midriasis is nothing but dilation of the pupil. The next term is nystagmus. It is a rapid involuntary movement of the eyeballs possibly caused by a disease of the central nervous system. It is associated with conditions such as vertigo. The next term is otagia. Oto means ear, algia means pain. Otagia is ear ache or ear pain. The next term is photophobia. Photo means light, phobia means fear. So photophobia is nothing but abnormal visual intolerance to light. 
The next is optosis. It is falling or drooling of the eyelid or slippage of any organ below its normal position. The next term is retinoblastoma. Oma means tumor. A tumor arising from immature retinal cells. Hence the term retinoblastoma. It accounts for 2% of the childhood cancers. The next is the next term is scotoma. It is an area of reduced or lost vision in the visual field. The next is strabismus. Misalignment of the eyeballs so that the eyes do not move in unison when viewing an object. The affected eye turns either medially or laterally with respect to the normal eye and the result is double vision which is nothing but diplopia. It may be caused by physical trauma, vascular injuries or tumors of the extrinsic eye muscles or the oculomotor or trochial or abductens cranial now. The next term is tinnitus. Tinnitus is nothing but a ringing, roaring or clicking in the ears. The next is tonometer. Tono means tension or pressure. Metron means to measure. So tonometer is an instrument for measuring the pressure, especially intraocular pressure. The next is trachoma, a serious form of conjectivitis and it is the greatest single cause of blindness in the world. It is caused by bacterium chlamydia trachomatis and the disease produces an extensive growth of subconjunctival tissue and invasion of the blood vessels into cornea which progresses until the entire cornea is opaque. And the final term is vertigo. Vertigo is nothing but dizziness. Vertigo is a sensation of spinning or movement in which the world seems to be revolving or the person seems to be revolving in space. It is often associated with nausea and in some cases vomiting. It may be caused by arthritis of neck or an infection of the vestibular apparatus. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe for further videos on medical coding and CTC training.